Hey, hey, what's up? So, I'm here to talk about Japanese stereotypes. Oh, one second, one second. Talk about Japanese stereotypes part one. Okay, so Japanese food. All right, so you know they get a little crazy, right? Raw food, raw fish. Okay, you know what I mean? They love their rice. You know that. Rice is everywhere. Uh, so those are one of the true stereotypes. Ramen, noodles, they love that ish. But the thing that gets to me about Japanese food, raw eggs. I ain't an athlete, as you can see clearly. I just don't get eating raw eggs, you know? You know what that is? Whip it up, yeah, pour it on top of their beef and rice. I'm like, mm, nah, ain't about that. So one of that's it. Their food is pretty much okay, can survive. You know, fried food, yeah, good. They fry everything, basically. Everything they fry. What a set of people of smoke. Jesus have mercy. I mean, Christ. Japanese people love to smoke. I'm, I'm dead serious. I don't know. I think they even smoke more than America, don't they? Papa smoke. Mama smoke. Grandpa smoke. Uncle, auntie, brother, sister. They just love to smoke. I mean, it's so hard to find women that don't smoke. And that's kind of a turn off for me, but I mean, it's whatever, to each their own. But they love to smoke. I guess it's because they don't really have lives. They go to school at a young age from Monday to Sunday. All right, that's a lie. Well, Monday to Saturday, basically. And even Sunday sometimes for club activities. Uh, yeah, for the weekend. But it's crazy. Why, why, why would I go to school? That's another. Uh. Japanese hygiene. Wow. Okay. For those who this might offend, women aside. But y'all need to get that sorted, man. I mean, I love good teeth. And I mean, the teeth, them uh -uh, double decker bus stuff going on. Like, it's like, uh, you know, when you go to a, football, uh, a stadium and you have a seat here, then there's no seat here, and then there's a seat here. So think of teeth being the persons in seats. And then the, back and forth. So the empty seats are where there's a gap or it's shifted forward. So seat, no seat. See, and they, they love it and they think it's sexy. Why are chaka chaka teeth jumbled up, the mash mouth teeth sexy and twisted? Oh, oh my God. It's, it's the, mm. but that's bad, not too bad. But the people that don't floss, swollen gums and this, this build up. Oh, mm. No, bad oral hygiene is just wrong, guys. Brush your teeth, okay? Please, it's not. Uh, oh my god, <sighs> right? So, discolored teeth turn off smoking and lots of coffee causes that, but yeah, so yeah. And then, you know what's funny when I just came here, you know, I said, Well, these, these some of these kids kind of smell a bit weird. But it's what they eat, it's in their diet. And then after spending some time in Japan, if you eat like them, you start to smell like them. I'm like, this, this, damn, that's me? That's my shit? Nah, yuck, it smells like seaweed and nah stuff. Right. <laughs> okay. Uh, Japanese, I know Asians are tight, that's what they say, but damn, Japanese women are so tight, yo, I mean, it, it's so hard to get in, you know, Japanese women definitely have the tightest purses, <laughs> you thought I was going to say, get your mind out of the damn gutter, you filthy persons, yeah, they don't really spend a lot of money, on you so yeah tight purses get it or not